Today is leg day, it's almost the end of week three, so remember every workout counts, I'm really getting into the groove of things now, so you should be feeling uh, very motivated and uh, just ready to get through this transformation successful. One thing that I want to consistently remind you on throughout this transformation is that this transformation workout is for you. Okay, you might see me in a gym training very hard and intense and very heavy, but you just need to pick a weight that's suitable for you, you know, that you're reaching failure at. With this intensity, you will get the best results. And it doesn't matter if my client is a beginner, advanced, or trying to burn fat, build muscle. This is exactly how I train them, exactly how you see myself train, because I know it produces results. So you just gotta keep the intensity the same, so you're keeping your heart rate up to burn the fat, However, and, and be very focused in the gym, if you're not going in there to chat and uh, just mess about. It's all about quality in the gym, not quantity. Just pick that weight, perfect for you, that'll allow you to reach failure every time and you will get the results. So anyway, we've got legs, let's get charged, let's get intense and motivated and I'll see you at the gym. I'm still on the road heading from New York to Columbus, Ohio. I got my workout in early so I'll be showing you what to do from the bodybuilding.com exercise database. Today we're going to start with one high repetition set of leg extensions. Our one set will consist of a drop set of around 100 repetitions. So pick a weight where you're going to feel comfortable with that you're going to reach failure at around 20 repetitions. And then you're going to continue to drop and try to get anywhere between 10 to 20 repetitions before dropping again and again and again until you reach 100 repetitions. You should be reaching absolute failure before you make that drop set. Next up is leg press where we'll be doing more high repetition sets. We'll be doing three sets of 30 repetitions with this one. Pick a weight that challenges you that you're gonna reach failure at around 20, 25 repetitions and then just rest and pause until you get to 30 repetitions. Now we're switching our focus to hamstrings where we'll be doing standing hamstring curls and we'll be doing three sets of 20 repetitions. We're still doing high reps for this exercise as well, but it'll be a single leg concentration curl. Our final lift will be hack squats. We're gonna do three sets of 30 repetitions. And again, I like to reach failure at around 20 to 25 repetitions, and then I rest and pause until I get to 30. So when I say rest and pause, do a single rep. Rest a little bit, do a single rep until you reach your 30 repetitions. It's my third day here in New York. So far everything's been going good with my meals and my cardio and my training. Um, I had to train quite late last night after I finished uh, the meetings. I think I got to the gym around 8 o'clock which is kind of late for me. However, I got my weight training and my cardio in. And the meals have been a little bit more difficult because uh, in these meetings it seems like I'm doing all the talking. So uh, it, it is really hard for me to eat during the meetings. So what I've been doing is eating in the taxi, uh, going from meeting to meeting, which has still worked out okay. I, I've just really had to eat fast. And I've had to have a couple more shakes than I'd planned because uh, just out of convenience, it seems easier. But it, it, I'm still getting all my meals in uh, during the day. That's the main thing. And what I've been doing for cardio, which is, which is great, is in this hotel, there, there seems to be a lot of flaws. So I'm going up and down the stairwell. Instead of going to the gym and just doing the same thing um, on a bike or on a treadmill, going up and down the stairs really gets the heart rate up and I'm able to really, um, really work the legs as I'm going up and down. So the stairwell has worked out perfect. So that's what I'm going to do for cardio now. Um, I was going to go outside, but there seems to be a lot of snow out there. So I think I'm going to give that a miss. So as you can see on the streets of New York here, there's a lot of snow and I don't want to be slipping on my butt. So 
I've got my fridge. These are the meals that I've been using. Just in packets here. So I'll grab out four meals here for the day. And what I'll do is just put them in these containers. I've been washing these containers every evening after I've been eating out of them. And I'll fill them up with these bags. Join me tomorrow while I bust the myth on a no-carb diet.